Hello and welcome to one of my favorite spots here on top of the world, Signal Hill Mountain Road. I'm up here because current times have us all cooped up inside, but now if I want to drop the face mask and explore, adventure a little, Suzuki has just dropped off this, the brand new Vitara Brezza. So let's kick off the adventure. recently launched here in Uzanzi, this is the car which Suzuki has brought. Fits right in between the Suzuki Ignis and of course the Suzuki Vitara. So this all new Vitara Brezza is exactly what you'd expect it to be. On the outside it's got its cute and charming looks. I love the way particularly here on this GLX version I've got at the moment, it's got that two-tone paint color scheme. That's this red exterior paint with a blackened roof. I've seen a couple of other cool colors out there and really it lets it stand out from the crowd. You attach this with its crossover stance which has become ever so important here in South Africa and even globally. People seem to love them, the practicality of a crossover and this seems to be the perfect car for around the city or for smaller families you actually are getting loads of space in the cabin and it just seems to tick all the boxes The interior of the Suzuki Vitara Brezza really is a very, very impressive place to be seated. I find it doesn't feel cheap in any way, despite the affordable price point. You are getting a well put together, well trimmed interior, and here on this GLX model, we're getting a lot in the way of standard features. I'm talking this large 7 inch touchscreen based display. It's got everything here from Apple's CarPlay to Android Auto, easy to jump into, of course that's all your streaming services, and very easy to use, neat and colorful system. Then you've got climate controlled air conditioning here, I've got a dimming rear view mirror, steering wheel mounted controls, and I love these, even the instrumentation cluster's got those colorful rings around it, and those too I believe can be customized to set your color and mood. With the central armrest, which is really comfortable, cup holders throughout, even a cooled storage box here up above the glove box, there really is nothing to complain about here. You're also getting lots of headroom seated up front, and if I'm seated behind myself now, you'll see there's nothing to complain about seated back there either. And that includes its large 328 litre boot with the seats folded up, as well as seats which drop completely flat. Then we move on to what Suzuki do and what they do best, and that is building cracking compact cars. And you find this Vitara Brezza, there's no wonder it sold almost half a million in India where it's produced. Produced by Maruti Suzuki, I expected this car, because of its price point starting below 245,000 Rand, to feel a bit cheap and flimsy, maybe a bit nasty the plastics, but in fact it doesn't. They've done such an excellent job of pulling it off. Now whether driving here on a smooth piece of mountain road, or otherwise driving around the city, or driving pretty much anywhere, you find it's a very satisfying place to continue your journey. So finally to conclude, the Vitara Brezza, well I think to sum it up, it's pretty simple really. Much in keeping with what Suzuki do and what I think they do best, it offers value on every element. It's got the space, the pricing is certainly great value starting from between 244,900 Rand up to the range-topping GLX 
for 309,900 Rand. You can either have it with a 5-speed manual transmission or, as I have it at the moment, the 4-speed auto box. You've got the touchscreen based media system, particularly here on this GLX. I got a dimming rear view mirror, I got electric windows all around, a backing up camera, keyless entry and go, and even a cooled glove box. You name it, it's got it. You pack the ISOFIX mounting points, the ABS, the EBD, you pack the Suzuki four year 60,000 kilometer manufacturer service plan or five year 200,000 kilometer manufacturer mechanical warranty and I think what more could you ask for? If the Suzuki Brezza is to follow some of the trail which it's followed in India I think we're on to a winner here and we're going to see many many of them on our roads. From me Jason of Technobock until next time I'll see you guys soon. Cheers for now.